All right. And so when thinking about the holistic review process, I think it's important to think of the things that a school is assessing as falling into two separate buckets. So bucket one is your heart factors. Um, I also refer to these sometimes as your quantitative factors. So they're your numbers. Um, they consist of your LSAT score and your undergraduate GPA. Bucket two is your soft factors, oft, often referred to um, as your qualitative factors. Um, and these are the things that aren't your numbers. They consist of everything else in your application packet, namely the things that paint a fuller picture of who you are. Um, while it is true that most schools do place the most weight on your hard factors, I would say that hard factors actually only consist of approximately two thirds, give or take, um, of any admissions decision. So that means that about one third, give or take, um, of any admissions decision is determined by soft factors. And that is by no means insignificant. So for most applicants, soft factors truly are what really seals their admissions fate for better or worse. And so I think it's important to know that as we start off, because it's important to understand why it's so important to make the most of the holistic review process by using your soft factors to your benefit every single chance that you get.